This is not exactly my area of expertise, but they said the word digital in the email they sent me, so I'll give it a shot. This is the Suaoki air compressor. Just taking a quick look over at the Amazon listing, it says Suaoki DC 12 volt portable digital air compressor tire inflator, two nozzle adapters, 1.54 foot air hose, 9.67 foot cord with cigarette plug, max 100 PSI for tires, balls, and inflatable objects. The retail price on it is about 90 bucks, but they say it's $39.99 right now. And it says rapid inflation, only six and a half minutes to quickly top up a tire. Model number's there. It says from zero to 35 PSI, six and a half minutes per tire, completely flat to full. Definitely worth a shot. I will say getting out on the road, getting a flat tire, and not having an air compressor to pump it back up once you patch it, yeah, this thing could be very handy. Or even more so for like soccer games, basketball games, anything where you need to pump up something could be really useful. So here it is, it's in a little carrying case, very handy for the car again. Inside of the carrying case on this side, there appears to be user manual, overview and information and how to operate it, power input, maximum current of 10 amps, and different languages. Here is the air compressor unit itself, seems to be all self-contained, very nice. So you may not even need the carrying bag. So here's your little LCD display on the front. It says M plus and minus, on, off. And then here it says off, light, flash, and SOS. And of course this does not have a built-in battery, so doing this is not gonna do anything. On the side here would presumably be your air hose. So it just sort of pulls out like that, and you could screw it onto your tire. On the bottom, You've got your attachments. So you could either attach this for pumping up a ball of some sort, attach this for pumping up some sort of inflatable. And then of course back here, you have your DC input. This is where you're actually going to power it. And there's a lot of cord there. Not sure how that's all gonna fit back in. We will make it work. And you know what, as I just mentioned, I don't have a way to actually plug this in in here. So we probably ought to head out to the car. So let's go ahead and plug this thing in. So you can see over here it flashed red. It says 0.0, .0 PSI. So when we hit down, we get a light, then we get a flashing red light, then we get the SOS, I don't know Morse code, I probably know this one, but can't take the time to be bothered. And then we click off, and it's off. There's a M plus and a minus, so if I hit M, it goes to barometric pressure, and then KPA, so just different methods of measuring. But back to PSI, that's where a lot of people are just gonna spend their time, at least where I am. And if you wanna actually turn it on, you just hit this button here. As you can see, it's kind of loud. But since we're here anyway, let's go ahead and test it with a couple of these extensions. I have a pretty pitiful little beach ball here. It's lost most of its air. So if I go ahead and screw this into place, pop it into the beach ball, and hit go. Yep, filled it up super, super quickly. Same here, I've got a bit of a pitiful deflated soccer ball. Put this ball inflation tip on. It says inflate eight to 10 pounds. That was super, super fast. May not be full enough. It's pretty close though. It said seven or seven and a half. There we go, now it says eight. And this is definitely as hard as you'd want it. And my tire is a little bit low, as you can see, 28 and a half PSI. Should be around 30 to 32. That's probably enough. So yeah, all in all, after a little bit of testing here, I would say it definitely does what it says on the tin, gets all the things accomplished that it's supposed to. Keep in mind, you do have to have this plugged into your car in order to use it. There's no other way to plug it in or anything, but it is very convenient to have everything all in one little package like this. To have something you can kind of just stick in the back of the car while you're on the go, and at any time you can either inflate soccer balls, basketballs, whatever else you need to, if your kids are into sports or anything, or inflate your tires if your tires happen to go low or flat while you're on the road. Definitely a handy little guy to have with you. So I'll put a link down in the description to where you can pick one of these up if you are interested. Thanks so much to Suaoki for sending this out for me to take a look at. Thanks to you guys for watching. Leave a thumbs up down below if you like this video and subscribe to receive more when they become available and I will see you again next time.